it is me, Rachel, and uh, I have something to show you today, and it is new dolls! Yay! <laughs> yeah, so as you can see, <laughs> it's a new blood set. It's two walls, Kirsty and Casey. Yeah, <laughs> it's a relatively a new set. So I guess my some kind of review and unboxing will be relevant. <laughs> so yeah, it is a special edition. Where is it? Yeah, <laughs> somewhere it says that. Yeah, it's a special edition. And uh, Twiwels have never got uh, any dolls, so it's first ones. And I really hope it's uh, not the last ones. <laughs> They're very cool. I'm not, uh, uh, how you can say it, it's, uh, I'm not a very huge uh, Brides fan. Well, as for a child, like when I was uh, little. So I don't have any, some kind of nostalgia feeling or something like this. But I still, I am nonetheless uh, really appreciate uh, Brides brand at, as well, at all, yeah. It's a really good dose. And <laughs> yeah, don't mind, uh, I believe it's uh, Casey, that her head is <laughs> a little bit in, in a weird position, yeah. It, it's not my fault, it, it came like this. But I think it's kind of funny, <laughs> funny looking, because they both uh, often argue and uh, they have some fights, so it's something like canon looking like they had a fight and now they are beating on each other whatever my nose <laughs> yeah the box is really cool as well as you can see it's a really interesting uh, shape as uh, other brats dolls boxes they often do some wacky and interesting uh, shapes here's a pink hot pink hot pink ribbon in a little bow because yeah the signature color is pink Kirsty and Casey yeah <laughs> mean girls alert the twivels it's the twivels Kirsty and Casey the seriously evil twin duo who are out to wreck the boats planks as long as they don't wreck themselves first I don't see really, I can't really see, let me, clad in pink and ready to rule the fashion world, at least they think so. These girls are nothing but bad news. <laughs> yeah, they are like uh, comic relief characters, like, they are not the main antagonist force or something like this, they are, they are some kind of uh, funny minions. <gasps> minions! <laughs> so yeah, but they are still very iconic like uh, their phrases yeah here on the borders you can see some other their iconic phrases and uh, words like whatever loser would you like calm down get a new one or oh, get a new one it's very iconic like it was about a cat i guess you have seen this meme like what's your problem yeah <laughs> they are like you, you get what they are. <laughs> They're pretty simple, but it's uh, their cartoon look. It's uh, very close to the original, as, uh, as much close as it could be. So there is not much you can ask for. And I believe there is a poster inside. Yeah, poster inside. That wins and they are seriously evil. One set. <laughs> And uh, yeah, they got uh, stands, that's very cool, that's very good, because uh, sometimes when brass dolls don't have those stands, it's uh, a very big pain to make them stand or to pose them, because it's brats, you know, <laughs> their heads huge, they fall over all the time. Like, I got uh, last year Pride set with uh, Nebra and Roxy, 
and for some kind of reason they don't have doll stands but it's a special edition set it's a limited edition set well not limited but still it's it's not some kind of regular usual release and they don't have doll stands they don't come with them and it was so much pain to make them stand because my god do they fall over all the time <laughs> Anyway, let me get them out of the box and uh, I'll show you again them and what they're coming with. Yay! Let's, let's get them out. So we are back and they are free! Yeah! <laughs> As you can see, yes, they are... Uh, those stands are not quite uh, the usual ones. They are just like this... Uh, like figure stands, they have this uh, little stands, and they have holes in their shoes. So you just poke them in, and they stand still. It's better than nothing, nonetheless. Like it's not the usual stands, but they look pretty much uh, cleaner and nicer than the usual stands, and uh, they work. So this is great. They, don't, they will not fall over again. So yes, here our Kirsty and Casey. I'm very sorry, but I don't remember who is who, so please bear with me. So yeah, <laughs> let's say this is Casey and this is Kirsty, okay? I, 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 am, I have a feeling that I'm wrong, but <laughs> please bear with me. So their faces are quite the same as in the cartoon yeah. and the mold for the head shape as well they have a new head mold I believe yeah 2023 ah two well <laughs> maybe they were in the works all the way back then they have little heart shaped earrings and uh, our Casey, well, <laughs> she have a hot pink bowl in her hair. They have uh, the same hairstyle but different accessories. Like here, she have a bow, and the other one has some kind of pink tiara with little pearl-like beads. Soon, all the way. Oh no, not all the way. <laughs> no pearls on the back. That's. That's quite a touch. <laughs> Their dresses are very simple, pretty much simple. Not some kind of uh, high detailed fashion here, but it's their iconic looks, so it's understandable and uh, that's nice. Their hot pink, very short <laughs> dresses with uh, white uh, line and white buttons. The buttons, by the way, I believe, yeah, they're real. They soon on, so that's a very nice touch. That's a quite the detail. Like it's a simple uh, outfit. Ooh, don't fall. <laughs> yeah, they still tend to fall if you stand them not quite carefully. Yeah. So the outfits are pretty simple, but they are done with uh, as much detail and care as possible. So as for shoes, it's uh, iconic Bratz doll shoes, very big platforms, sandals with hot, hot pink again. Their signature color, they are all about pink. It's their color. So yeah, <laughs> I believe they should pop off like uh, on usual Bratz dolls. Yeah. So it pops off. So if you have <laughs> some other brass dolls that you want to wear some hot pink big platform oh big big platformy shoes, you, you can give them. I'm not sure it will be it will look good, but none however <laughs> nonetheless, however, anyway. I really hope it will be not the last, uh, the first and the last uh, release for 
to use those because they are very I call it, they are very cool and uh, I believe they should have some other release maybe with some more detailed fashion with more with with some other different look because there are a lot of opportunities you can give them other hairstyles you can give them a different uh, makeup like it's it's all here accessories like imagine some other earrings or uh, jewel <laughs> jewelry at all some kind of uh, I necklace yeah i i, I have remembered <laughs> Some necklaces, some earrings, some bracelets, maybe even rings, but I, I'm not sure. Did breasts have rings? I guess I didn't. Well, <laughs> there, there are a lot of different opportunities, yeah. Oh, and by the way, she has this little bandage on her nose because she, in the cartoon, in lore <laughs> according to lore and canon she all the time very much often gets her nose kicked or some other injury uh, following the uh, her nose to get hurt or she has or she had some uh, surgeries plastic surgeries with her nose a lot so yeah her nose is <laughs> her weak spot it's her Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> she always gets her nose hurt for some reason or another. So yeah, <laughs> they, by the way, have different uh, face expressions. Well, I guess you noticed, like she is more confident, more like smug face, and she is more calm and uh, uh, not giving a damn <laughs> about anything. Not my problem you know <laughs> Ooh, sorry and they have uh, brushes the old good uh, breads star shaped uh, brushes but hot pink again but i don't know why because they have this buns for her for the hairstyle so i don't know how are you supposed to use these brushes but okay <laughs> i guess it's just a uh, uh, the tradition already so you you must uh, put brushes uh, for the doll into the box with her even with it even if uh, its hair doesn't need to be brushed or it can't be brushed if you just don't uh, if you restyle your hair yeah you, you got me <laughs> and they have a posture yeah I believe, yeah, it's the same art as in in, on, in the box. <laughs> Let me unwrap it. Yeah. So here it is. Ooh. Here's one side of the posture. Yeah, it's the same art as in the box. As for the background, it's as well the same as their background in the box. Yeah, I believe you have seen, you, you remember. It's uh, their office. Yeah. So it's the same as in the box. On the other side, yeah, it's again same artwork, but now on the background there are their different uh, phrases and uh, signature phrases and uh, sayings as well as in the box. So it's very nice posture. I <laughs> I would love to put it somewhere. It's a very nice tradition that Brass uh, did, and uh, I guess they still have it, like putting posters uh, with their dolls. Mm, it's a very nice thing. So that's about it, I guess. They not come with uh, a lot of stuff, as you can see, and as you noticed, and as you know already, but nonetheless. However, anyway, <laughs> this is a very nice set and uh, I'm very glad I was able to get it. It was it was not <laughs> easy, as, my, as I can say in short. So yeah, I'm very glad they're here and I'm very glad I own them. 
and the box. I'm very glad that the box design is uh, so good that uh, you can open it and keep it the same. Like you don't need to tear it to shreds to get the dolls out as it may be with some other releases or some other brands. So that's very nice. I, I really like the box so I would love to keep it and I can keep it. <laughs> so yeah, this is a very nice thing. Okay, <laughs> I guess that's about it. Thank you for watching, for someone, somebody <laughs> watching. And uh, see you around, I guess. Yeah. I can't end the videos. <laughs> well, wait. All, all right. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Uh, see you around. Yeah. <laughs>